Welcome to my channel, it's Bomi here. So, today I'm doing a Shuri uh, Black Panther makeup tutorial. I don't know who Shuri is, she's the sister of Black Panther, also the princess, and um, I filmed an intro and the outro, and they both got deleted. So, this is my intro. <laughs> Enjoy. I'm going to attempt to make this a voiceover, I've never done one, so please bear with me. So with my eyebrows, I used an e.l.f. eyebrow kit. This thing is only like $3, so if you don't know what to use with your eyebrows, definitely recommend this. I am using the color dark, and I'm using the gel part of it. Oh, and I'm using a um, Anastasia uh, eyebrow brush, angle brush. There you go, that's what it's called. <laughs> To conceal my eyebrows, I'm using the LA Girl Pro Concealer. I don't know what color this is, don't know where to find it on the tube, but I'm also using a C-shaped e.l.f. Um, eyeshadow brush to conceal uh, my eyebrows. On to the eyeshadow. I'm using the NYX eyeshadow base in the color 03. I'm putting it on my eyelids with the same brush I used to conceal my eyebrows. To set the eyeshadow base, I'm using the Masquerade palette by Juvia and I'm using this brown shade. No idea how it's pronounced. All the names of the eyeshadows we put up on the screen. So throughout the Black Panther movie, Shuri has a purple pinkish eye look going on. And so I wanted, I didn't want to use a brown in the crease. So I felt like it was gonna make the purple too dark. So I used a pink as my crease color with the Wen Wild eyeshadow brush. So one part I skipped over was I attempted to use this NYX eyeliner that was a purple shimmer color and it wasn't doing what I wanted to do. It was too light. It wasn't all purple enough. So I went into the same Juvia palette and I used the sparkly purple, shimmery purple, whatever you want to call it. And I lightly put it on my eyelids so it wouldn't be too dark, but it would still be that purple I wanted, the royal purple. I went back in with that same pink color on a fluffy eyeshadow brush and I blended the pink and the purple together. So I went back in with the same purple I was using before and I took it on a C-shaped eyeshadow brush and I put it in the corner of my eyes to make it have like that kind of glow but without using a highlight, if you know what I mean. Probably not, but yeah. To prime my face, I'm using the Knit Angel Veil Primer. So for my foundation, I'm using the Wet n Wild Photo Finish Foundation. This is a really cheap foundation. I think it's like $5. I got it at CVS that recently just started carrying to, uh, more of the darker shades of this foundation and honestly I'm not a huge fan of it maybe it's because I picked my wrong color but I thought it was just too cool toned for me and along with my foundation I'm using the NYX liquid illuminator in the color gold to mix it with my foundation to give it a warmer tone look it didn't work I 
I tended to use the LA Girl Pro foundation to warm up the previous foundation I just put on my face because it was more in the warmer orange toned. I'm using the same LA Girl Pro concealer as I did for my eyebrows and putting it under my eyes. To set slash highlight my face, I'm using the Sephora Collection Contour Palette. So for Sherry's rosy cheeks, I'm using the Tarte Party Blush with an e.l.f. blush brush. So for the dots Sherry has on her face, I'm using the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the color Milk. And for the brush, I'm using an e.l.f. crease brush that I thought was a perfect circle shape and super dense, so it made really good dots. So she has six dots under both of her eyes and then six more dots above both of her eyebrows. I went over each dot again just so the white would pop out more. She has an additional four columns of four right above her eyebrows. So for my lipstick, I'm using the Kat Von D Lolita Liquid Lipstick. And I, 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 I saw her and I was like, I, I want braids now. And I haven't had braids in a while and I learned how to do them just for this video. Not gonna lie. Okay, so I'm gonna take pretty much the crown of my head. And so she, her signature look was a bun and I'm gonna make a bun. Around her bun, she has this purple, um, like braid-looking thing, and I wasn't sure if it was purple. It was if it was a purple braid that she had in her hair, if it was like a ribbon. I had purple hair, purple and black uh, hair. I saved from when I got purple and black braids over the summer, and I, um, I yeah, I put it into a braid, and I'm gonna tie it around the bun.
do this video again. My outro got deleted. I filmed the whole thing and now it's, it's gone somewhere in the um, the world of the internet. <laughs> so uh, my um, social media links will be uh, down below in the little down bar thing. Um, hit the subscribe button if you want. Please, please do. Um, and hit the like button. Okay. Peace out. Love you. Bye.